Hello you guys, I hope that everybody is having a very very happy new year, happy 2022. This is my first video of the new year and it is an H&M try on haul. I have so many clothes that I've been just buying over the last several months from H&M. A lot of the things that I'm showing you guys in this video don't even have tags on them anymore because I've worn them so so much. If you guys are new here, my name is Lexi. I upload college lifestyle, fashion, and beauty content on my channel. Be sure to follow me on Instagram. I'm also super active on there and I also have all of my social medias linked in the description box if you guys want to follow me elsewhere. Little preface, the um, black pieces in this video are so linty and I didn't realize them until I started editing and it's driving me crazy, but just know, I own a work roller. Before we start, I do want to say I will have absolutely every single thing that I talk about in this video linked in the description box below. And if you guys are inspired to buy anything from this video and plan on making a purchase, pretty, pretty please use the links that I provide because I do make a very, very small commission from your purchase at no additional cost to you for informing your purchase. So that helps me out a lot. And yeah, let's get into it. So I will go ahead and start with basics. I do have some really fun, funky pieces in here and I was tempted to start with those, but something's telling me to just start with basics because I have been wearing these things so so much non-stop ever since I got them and now that I have them I do not think that I could live without them the first thing I want to talk about is this top that I am wearing right now and it is just this ribbed cropped long sleeve top obviously from H&M and it is in this like light beige sort of taupey color I don't know if it's like doing any justice with my lighting right here right now but it is a beautiful like nice cool neutral color that's super super versatile I think it's a great layering piece I think it's a really fun piece to wear on its own for just like a really chill sort of model off-duty look I kind of went crazy in the basics department because I have so many like fun colorful statement pieces And sometimes it can just feel like a task to pick out an outfit because I'm like worried about what matches what so I went ham on basics Okay, I'm just letting you guys know that right now I did get this same top in white and I also got this same top in black. They fit really great They do wash and dry well, but I will say it did shrink just a little bit and all also, the top itself is pretty short. So for instance, I have a very short torso and I really like that this is a true crop top on me. But when I do raise my arms, the bottom of my bra does tend to show, which I don't mind. I love crop tops, but if you guys are like a little weary about that or have a longer torso, this might not be the ribbed crop top long sleeve for you. Next up, I have more cropped long sleeve shirts, you guys. It's this cotton jersey material and it is this black long sleeve crop top, literally the same fit as this one that I'm wearing and the other two that I showed you, except this one is not ribbed, it's just a cotton jersey material, which is really, really nice just because sometimes I don't really always feel like wearing ribs clothing, even though it like stretches and contours my body very, very well. Sometimes you just want something without texture. So I did get this in black and I also got it in white, of course. The last two basics that I am absolutely obsessed with that I have been wearing like crazy and are just great layering pieces are these two knit turtleneck they're considered sweaters but i kind of wear them and style them like long sleeve turtlenecks and they are a nice rib knit material they're a moderate thickness if i'm honest like not too thick not too thin same ordeal with this black one i have been loving wearing these tops like tucked into jeans with like fun jackets and stuff over top these pieces have been really really easy for me to wear if i want to go for like a more like elevated chic and sophisticated look without trying it's literally just like throwing on a top with some jeans and tucking it in or throwing a jacket over top of them but these tops are like great with blazers love 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 these so much next up i do have outerwear they are my three favorite pieces in this entire haul the first piece i wear all the time i talk about it in so many of my vlogs and it is this cropped puffer vest in black and i was so tempted to like not film this video because this is definitely a collective haul and a lot of the things they were out of stock or very low in stock and I was like why would I upload this video if they don't even have them on the site anymore as of now all of these pieces are back in stock in the same colors and everything so definitely check them out if you're interested but I wear this all the time I actually went to the king of prussia mall I did do a vlog when my mom came to visit me in Pennsylvania we went to the king of prussia mall and I bought this there but now they do have it online in black for a long time they didn't have it in black they had it in like 
light green and this red color they also have it in this color that i'm wearing right now like this beige but the black it just hits a little different i think it's so so flattering and it adds just a little bit of like i don't know like an edgy feel to any outfit while also being a really really practical piece i personally love to wear this as a content creator especially if i'm like vlogging or filming that day because i can just slide my camera in this pocket and i don't have to like dig in my bag for my camera and like make a huge scene out of it so i really do love this it is very very warm in my opinion and i think it's just a really great staple piece to elevate or just add a little oomph to any outfit on that same wavelength i do have the jacket version of that cropped puffer vest and it is just this black cropped puffer jacket now this i got this in an extra large because i bought this around black friday at the time it was like a new arrival on the site and in the store so everybody was trying to buy it and they really had very low stock in the size that i originally wanted because i thought i was going to get like a medium but because this jacket is very very cropped i'm really happy with the extra large and i don't want to say that the jacket necessarily runs small but it is a very very short jacket and i do like jackets that of course i can wear multiple layers underneath so it is roomy but it's not something that i feel like looks like it's absolutely swallowing me and engulfing me and most of the things at h&m at least in the tops and stuff i'm a small or if i want a little more room a medium and it's an extra large and i like the way it fits so do with that what you will i also got this same jacket in this beige color and this kind of matches the top that i'm wearing right now something that i love about these like cropped puffer pieces are they are so easy to wash like for instance if i'm wearing makeup with this one i will notice that like my makeup will like sort of rub off on the collar of it i thought it was stained but then i just threw it in the wash and then just hung it to dry and it was like good as new it puffed right back up so this is a really really great good quality piece that i know will have for a long time i will say that these puffer jackets are not super super thick here in georgia which is where i am right now for winter break daily the weather has been around like the low 50s to the mid 60s maybe sometimes in like the mid 40s too and like these jackets have been good for that but once i'm back in pennsylvania i don't know if we'll have a winter day warm enough for me to wear this jacket so just keep that in mind this next piece i am actually pretty obsessed with i have yet to wear it, it does still have the tag on it and i got this in a medium and this is just like this really really oversized flannel shirt and it literally fits like a jacket on me i honestly could have gotten an extra smaller small on this but i don't mind the medium um it's just really really big it's fun to wear i feel like this is something that i would throw on running around my apartment cooking cleaning or like just like having a day in organizing i think this is like something that's fun to style it looks like something that i would find at urban outfitters that i would not want to spend urban outfitters money on so yeah i really like it it's this sort of like brown and black i don't know i typically don't go for like really more masculine pieces like this but it does give off like a really cute androgynous vibe next up oh my gosh i am so excited about this piece you guys and i'm just so excited to like get all cute and like actually wear it out it's this white oxford shirt and i am not the biggest fan of shirts that like get super wrinkly easily but this shirt was so easy to iron and honestly it doesn't really crease as easily as other oxford shirts that i've had in the past have so i really like this it is a bigger shirt i got this in a size small i could have probably sized down to an extra small but i don't mind the kind of loose and baggy fit and something that i am super excited to wear this with is this black rib knit sweater vest and oh my gosh i just have a whole outfit in mind for this like follow me on instagram so when i put together this outfit you guys know exactly where the idea originated from this video but i'm super excited to wear like this oxford shirt this rib knit sweater vest with like black vegan leather leggings and like a uh, boo and oh my gosh i'm just so excited to style this it's gonna be so fun it's like preppy edgy very chic at the same time but once again something super super easy to style lots of neutral pieces so far but now we have some colors that we're gonna be getting into first things first First is this orange turtleneck sweater this is a crop sweater on me because I have a short torso like when I wear it just like down it's not cropped like my stomach doesn't show so if I am feeling like I want a little more crops I'll just do the good old-fashioned bra tuck to crop it and I just love bra tucking my sweatshirts my sweaters I've been bra tucking the heck out of things that like aren't necessarily crops on me and it's so fun and I just feel like it's just 
you get like two different looks out of an item like you can wear it down and then it looks like a completely different piece when you let your bra tuck it so yes i love this a lot and i got this because of this hat you guys i am so so excited about this bucket hat and it is just so adorable and it actually goes with this sweater so i saw this hat on the model before it was released online and i told myself i'm not buying the sweater until the hat is released and finally the hat was released and i have them both and i'm super super excited to wear these i think it's going to be a really fun hat to wear of course like not now when i have my hair up <laughs> but when my hair is down i am getting braids soon i think it's going to be really fun to wear when i have my braids next up i get so many compliments on this piece but specifically the color of this piece and it is this rib knit cardigan in this really pretty pink color it's almost like a pinky purple i can't really explain like a bubblegum pink color maybe but like a little cooler i love this so so much i got this in a large because i did want that oversized sort of baggy fit but just the details on this sweater are really fun like i love how this like v is cut out and the lining around the neckline is super super fun and i also love the tortoise shell buttons on this sweater i do like to give this a french tuck because it kind of just looks like blah if i don't but once i give it a french tuck and i can like i don't know show off my waist a little bit it looks a little more purposeful and a little more fashionable Next up, if you guys have seen my most recent vlog, I did buy this in store and I bought two of them actually. I bought this one, it's a satin slip dress and what sold me was the back, like the back just like dips down and it's just so gorgeous and so flattering and I'm just so excited to wear this. I definitely see myself wearing this like probably closer to the spring summertime and then i also have this same dress in black and oh my gosh i'm like manifesting a really cute valentine's date for myself so i can wear this dress with like a red lip so i can like look super cute and hot and i just really want to wear this dress on valentine's day for some reason or at least a dress like it maybe a red dress on valentine's day would be more fitting but i'm manifesting a valentine's date for myself Let's take a moment of silence for the manifestation to just really sink in. Okay, we got it. <laughs> Next up is a piece that I'm so excited to wear. It's like a little too warm for me to wear this here in Atlanta, but I am excited to wear it one time back in Pennsylvania. And it is this ribbed, chunky knit dress it's a long dress it probably stops like right above my ankle but it looks so so cute with like boots and it just is a really chic and easy piece of style and also just very very warm and comfortable too it's literally like you're just wearing a tarp like a nice like blanket you're just walking around in a blanket but it's so fashionable that nobody would ever think that it's that comfortable you know so that is the last piece in this h&m haul i hope that you guys enjoyed my first video of 2022 i enjoyed filming it for you guys and be sure to head to the description box to shop any of these pieces that you are interested in getting for yourself i'm just like looking at all these clothes and looking at how much stuff i have to pack to go back to pennsylvania because i've been doing so much shopping here but that is not anybody's issue but my own if you made it this far into the video comment at least one video that you guys want to see from me this year or just like more kinds of videos that you want to see from me this year i'm just really excited for my channel and the content that i'm planning on creating this year it's gonna be very very exciting i already feel the momentum of this year being such a year of just like growth and prosperity for me and i am hoping the same for you guys i hope you guys feel inspired have some outfit ideas that you're excited to wear i also hope you guys are staying safe wearing your masks are vaccinated and have or are planning on getting your booster shots okay I am going to go ahead and sign off, but before I go, I want to remind you guys to spread kindness and always remember that the less you wander, the more you wonder. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.